Hi, in this video, I'll demonstrate how to run ANOVA in Microsoft Excel by using Data Analysis Tool Pack. So here is my data set. So this data is about household results index of 60 households. Out of these 60 households, 22 are located in village 1, 18 in village 2, and 20 in village 3. Right? And we are interested to find out whether these three villages significantly differ on account of household resilience index or not. So we will use ANOVA and how to do it. On the menu bar of Excel, click data and on right extreme you see here we have an option of data analysis. So this is data analysis tool pack. If it's not appearing in your Microsoft Excel, so then what you can do, you can make it available here by using the option of add in this. Now here you see, in this uh, toolbox, here you see, we have three types of ANOVA. The first one is single factor ANOVA. Single factor ANOVA is, is used when you are interested to compare two more than two groups of respondents or communities or uh, what I would say groups on any single factor. So as in this case, we want to compare three villages on single factor, that factor is household results index. So that's why we'll use the option one that is you know, single factor, this correct option. Then what we need, basically we need to give a range. But here you see, we select the data set. And make it sure that the data is in columns. Right? And if it's rows, then check this option. Second, also make it sure that you have checked the option of the labels in first row. Otherwise, deselect the text from the text selected range. Then select the alpha value. 0 0.05 is the standard one, default one. If you want to use a lower one, uh, it's fine. Just click OK. So you see here, so this is the result. And uh, if you look at the p-value, the p-value is far less than 0 0.05. So that what means Difference among three villages is statistically significant. In other words, we can say that the three villages significantly differ on account of household resilience index. Right? So if you want to find out so which village has highest resilience index, so then in the first table you can find it here. So these are the average values. So the village 1 is uh, ha having highest value that is 64 and village 2 is having 54 and village 3 is having 41. Right? So this is the way how we can carry out uh, uh, ANOVA in Microsoft Excel by using data analysis. Thanks for watching.